The voicemails. Are you worried, boys? Are you worried? Yeah, I can yeah. imagine. Since the story's broke, my brother has started leaving me voicemails just in case I'm being tapped, trying to get me in trouble. Every so often I wake up and there's a voicemail going, Hiya, Mr Manford, I've got them midget strippers you were after. <laughs> yeah, he said you can pay me dead kittens as usual. <laughs> Be a boring job. Do you think that'd be a boring job, though? Just sort of listening to voicemails? I have to listen to voicemails about four times anyway, because there's those people in there who leave a voicemail with their number so quick, <laughs> there's no way of listening to it. I, uh, give us a ring, 07656 You're like, Jesus, man, I'm not Rain Man, love. <laughs> We've all done a bit of unintentional phone hacking, haven't we? You know when someone's phoned you from their pocket? Have you done that, where they've left you a really long message? <laughs> Two and a half minutes from Sean, what could this be? And then you listen to it, don't you? You listen to every second, just in case they say something about you, eh? <laughs> be amazingly bad luck, wouldn't it, if you could hear them going, yeah, and anyway, I don't like that, Jason, he's a prick, yeah. <laughs> it's almost as bad luck as slagging someone off on a text and then sending it to that person. Have you done that? <laughs> you know, Frank is a bell end. Send to Frank. No thumbs, no! <laughs> Delete the battery out. Ah! Then you've got to think this through. How am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? And I'm only joking, Frank. I still don't know what you can do. <laughs> Messing about. <laughs> My mum used to phone tap all the time. I remember I was about 13. The phone would go, Jason, your girlfriend's on the phone. All right, mum, I'll get it up here. And then she'd stay on the phone, pretending to have put it down. But I could hear her breathing downstairs. So I just start making shit up. So, uh, when's our baby due? Yeah, you can both stop here if you want. Yeah, that's fine. Just live with us. Obviously, I stopped when she started crying. That, that's time. <laughs> right, it's time for our final act of the evening. <laughs> uh, he's a true legend of British comedy. He's been entertaining fans for 30 years. Fresh from his Lord of the Mints nationwide tour, please welcome Julian Clary! Thank you. Mind you don't peak too early. 